Hello everyone, my name is Kechan Chiriti, working as a assistant professor in Tigal Kishtar Engineering College. This video, I will explain uh, power quality and facts subject. Welcome to my channel. My channel name is Accelerate Your Research. In this video, we will explain power quality and facts subject. In playlist, click here, power quality and facts. So these are my previous videos related to power quality and facts subject. Uh, this is unit one and unit two. Just introduction. Okay, I will start my presentation. This is power quality and facts. Power quality and facts. This is R18 JNTH syllabus, 40 second semester. This video I will explain. You need to transmission lines and series and send reactive power compensation. In this second chapter, I will explain this series compensation at the midpoint AC transmission line. This topic I will explain. Series compensation at the midpoint AC uh, transmission lines. So this is my PDF. I will explain this uh, this PDF. This is the series compensation diagram. This is the midpoint uh, voltage. This is the active power and the reactive power. This is the output character waveform, uh, real and the reactive power characteristics. Okay. First, I will explain this diagram. In this diagram, series compensation diagram, in this circuit have Vs and Vm and Vr is the three voltage. This is the Vs is the sending end voltage. This is the Vm is the midpoint voltage and Vr is the receiving end voltage. In this series uh, compensation, this uh, this inductance and this uh, capacitance totally, this, this, this is the transmission lines model. In this transmission line model, this reactance divided into two parts for analysis purpose, Jx by two and Jx by two. This capacitance Jxc by 2, this Jxc by 2 is the injecting uh, capacitance. This is, this is the uh, capacitance injected in series. Okay, this uh, without compensation, this uh, supply Vs and receiving end voltage V and only this inductance. In this series compensation, injected this capacitor Jxc by 2 and Jxc by 2, the capacitive reactance. This is the phasor diagram. Here, this is the Vs is the sending end voltage. This Vr is the receiving end voltage. This Vm is the midpoint voltage. Okay. This up to here, this red color, Vs to Vm, uh, the reactance is Ji x effective by 2. Here also, Vm by Vm to this Vr, uh, capacitance minus J x, uh, x effective by 2. Here, this remaining, this, this portion, uh, capacitance jxc by 2 here also jxc by 2 okay this part this this capacitance is the uh, compensating capacitance this is the compensating capacitance or compensative uh, reactance this is the effective reactance this total x is the transmission lines uh, transmission line uh, reactance this total capital x total x is called jxc by 2 plus jx effective this is the total this diagram this is the this is a diagram. This is the trigonometric formula. It is O, A, B, C. Okay, this angle theta. This is ad, uh, adjacent side. Opposite. This is the opposite side. This hypo hypothesis side. Okay, here formulas. Cos theta is equal. To, here cos theta is equal. To adjacent side. Adjacent side means this O A. O A by O B. Okay, O A by O B. This sine theta is equal. To, here opposite side. Opposite side by hypothesis a b by is o b a b by o b this this trigonometry formula i applied in this uh, in this diagram okay here cos del by 2 is equal okay cos del by 2 is equal v m by v okay this second formula this formula for calculating active power P is equal to Vm into I. This is the active power formula for calculating active power. P is equal to Vm into I. Uh, I need Vm value and I value. This Vm is the formula. Cos del by two, cos delta by two is equal to Vm by V. Vm means here this two here mag uh, this Vm. This side voltage V in this uh, circuit Vm Vs is equal to Vm is equal to Vr. Okay, now we, we are is equal to V. I am applying, uh, I am writing here V. 
cos del by 2 is equal to Vm by V, this second formula. Next, Vm is equal to, next step, Vm is equal to this V, this V multiplying it, this cos del by 2. Vm is equal to V cos del by, uh, delta by 2. Vm is equal to V cos delta by 2. This is the cos formula, cos delta by 2 is equal. Next to sign delta by 2 is equal to opposite side. Opposite side means this J effect, J, J I X effective by this voltage V. Okay, this sign delta by 2 is equal to I into X effective by 2 by V. Next, I, I am finding I from this formula, I is equal to this V sine delta by 2 by X effective by T, X effective by 2. Next, I am substituting uh, I is equal to this 2 going to upwards. I is equal to 2V sine delta by 2 by X effective. Okay, finally, I got formula P is equal to Vm into I. Vm is equal to V cos delta by 2. Next, I is equal to 2V sine delta by 2 by X effective. Next, I am calculating this X effective value. X effective value is equal to total X is equal to X effective plus XC. Effective inductance plus this uh, capacitance. Okay, next X effective value is equal to X is equal to minus XC. Okay, minus XC means this capacit capacitive reactance value minus XC. Next, X effective is equal to X common, X common 1 minus X by 1 minus x by xc. Next, finally, x effective is equal to capital, uh, capital x, uh, 1 minus k. This k is equal to x by xc value, where k is the degree of series compensation. Okay. If we varying this k value, the active and reactive power will change in this uh, graph. Okay. This total formulas relate, uh, uh, this total formulas current and voltage and x effective value. This total related to analysis okay in this analysis of uncompensated ac transmission lines this sent compensated series sent compensated at the midpoint i explained previously now series compensation at the midpoint ac transmission line this total topics related analysis okay next this is the reactive power for, uh, reactive form power formula this is the active power formula this is the reactive power formula for calculating active power Active power P is equal to Vm into I. Vm is equal to P is equal to Vm. V, Vm is equal to V cos delta by 2 into I is equal to 2V sin delta by 2 into effective value. This this formula, this formula I is equal to 2V sin delta by 2 by X effective. I substitute here. Okay, finally I got 2 uh, P is equal to V cos delta by 2 into 2V sin delta by 2. This V and this two V's I multiplied here. P is equal to two V square by X effective sine delta by two into cos delta by two. Uh, finally, a formula uh, two sine theta cos theta is equal to sine two sine uh, two theta. I applied the that formula here. Okay, two sine theta by two cos theta by two. Uh, two sine theta cos theta is equal to sine two theta. The final formula P is equal to P square by X effective sine Delta, this is the uh, active power formula. P is equal to V square by X effective sine delta. Here, P is equal to V square by uh, this X effective sine delta. In this effective value, substituted here, X is equal to 1 minus K. X, uh, X effective is equal to X into 1 minus K. Uh, v square by X into 1 minus K sine delta. Next, for, for calculating the reactive power formula, QC is equal to I square into X effective. This is the react reactive for formula. QC is called 4 V square uh, by X square 1 minus K whole square. This I I is called 2 V square 2 V sine delta sine delta by 2 into X effective. This current formula uh, is substituted in this current. 2 is equal to 2 square is equal to 4. Next to this P is called V square. This sine delta by 2 is called sine square delta by 2. Next, effect, x effective is equal to x square minus 1 minus k whole square. Okay, I will, I will write here. Next, x effective value here, x effective value. Next, x effective is equal to here, x by xc is equal to k. Next, x effective is equal to k into xc. This x effective, k into x, I substitute here. Final formula, xc, uh, qc is equal to 
फोर वी स्क्वायर एक्स स्क्वायर वन माइनस के होल स्क्वायर साइन स्क्वायर डेल्टा बाई टू इन टू के एक्स दिस के एक्स एक्स एफेक्टिव एक्स एफेक्टिव इज कॉल्ड के एक्स दिस के एक्स सब्सिट्यूटेड इयर नेक्स्ट टू वी स्क्वायर बाई वन माइनस के स्क्वायर ऑफ वन माइनस कास्ट डेल्टा ओके दिस इन दिस फॉर्मा साइन स्क्वायर टेटा इज कॉल्ड वन माइनस कास्ट टू टेटा बाई डेल्टा वन माइनस कास्ट टू टेटा बाई टू ओके दैट फॉर्मा आई अप्लाइड हियर यू सी इज कॉल्ड टू वी स्क्वायर बाई एक्स वन माइनस के ओ स्क्वायर वन माइनस कास्ट डेल्टा Finally, I got this is the active power formula. This is the reactive power formula. This is the real and reactive power uh, power output waveforms. Okay, final this output form. This is the x axis del. This y axis is the this is the active power formula. Real power p maximum, two p maximum. This p comma q. Okay, here observe here. Okay. Here k value k is equal to zero. Okay, k is k is equal to zero. This is the uh, real power formula. Next, this is the k is equal to zero point two. K is equal to zero point two. Active power. This is active power. This is the reactive power. Reactive power here. This one. Next, this k is equal to zero point four. Okay, zero point four. Here, this is the real power. This is the reactive power. Q C is equal to v square by k in uh, k in K by one minus K whole square upon minus cos delta. Okay, here rapidly increasing this uh, reactive power when we are changing this uh, K value. K value means reactance K X by X C value. When we change X C by X value, the react uh, the reactive power will increasing like this. Okay, this is the series compensation, series ideal compensation analysis. In this uh, series ideal compensation, so we are injecting voltage and controlling current in transmission lines. Okay, this is the series compensation at the midpoint AC transmission lines. Okay. Thank you, thank you for watching this video.